I'm gonna try to keep the drift with this car. Can I keep it? Maybe. Oh yeah, I can. I, ha I can. I can. I'm not, I'm not doing so bad. Moving like the speed of sound. What is going on, guys? This is Bullet Train HD, and welcome back to the channel. Um, this is the question, guys. Where um, uh, uh, yeah, rough R U F B T R. 1860, no, 1986, excuse me, um, will Ruff still be continuing their, uh, their cars on Gran Turismo and other car manufacturer games and stuff, but if you guys are not new, subscribe, hit that like button for more, um, videos like this, but, um, that's the question, w w will they still continue to, um, be on games like like this for example Gran Turismo and you guys already know that you know Gran Turismo they, they've been around for a long time and uh, yeah who knows if they might you know not be on racing games anymore and people gonna look at it like oh well what happened to them who knows long story short they probably stopped because certain reasons, but we, I'm just what I'm saying. We don't know yet. So um, yeah, just let me your thoughts down below. But um, the matter of the situation is um, if the rough doesn't, you know, continue on being on console games or something, and still be there, will it? I, honestly, I don't know. But let me your thoughts. I bought a lot of stuff on the game, so man. Just wanna change my outfit. There we go. That's a little bit better. Ah, uh, well, this is the story of Rough. And um if I'm pronouncing it wrong, go ahead, bash me in the comments. But here it is. This is my I had this car for quite some time. I've, I had it since Need for Speed 2015. I just changed the color to like red. We're gonna hop on a different lobby and talk more about Rove and stuff. If you guys are not new, subscribe, hit that like button, and um, if you enjoy this video, oh man, wow, that's what that's going dead. on today. It's like no one's alive on this game. On this game, I'm just gonna jump on a uh, track. Sorry for the long wait. Damn, it's been like five minutes. What's going on today? It's almost a weekend and everyone's like, Ooh. There it is. Alright, here we go. I'm driving a rough. On the channel. And, um. Yeah, rough. Looks like a Porsche, don't it? <laughs> it's not. This is my drift bell too, so. It's not gonna do very well on this track, but whatever. But he is what it is. It is what it is, y'all. Nice, pretty. This is a nice drift build, though. Nice little random drift build. It's got some angle, though. I like it. It's got some nice angle.
Yeah, he's up behind me. I'm not going to go very fast in this car, dude, just to let you know. It's not meant to do this. It's not meant to do this, man. So, um, yeah, we're off. Will this be the end? Question mark. Who knows? I would like them to still continue. Since Porsche is now here, I mean, Ruff should have a more of an opportunity to um, still, you know, be around, and not just die off. Do you guys care? I'm gonna ask you guys again. Holy shit! Do you guys care that Ruff exists or not, or still gonna be in Gran Turismo or Forza or whichever? Actually, it's not in Forza. It's more in Gran Turismo side, but who knows? The same, like the best Porsche one on that pack. The Porsche is, you know, finally on Grand Turismo. Hell yeah, I am. Of course, I'm. Of course, I'm happy about it. Everyone's like, uh, write one of my comments. Um, it's just a Porsche, you know. Calm down and stuff, dude. It's been a long. This Grand Turismo's the first time ever having Porsche. It's amazing. I've been waiting for too long to have Porsche on Grand Turismo, and it's finally coming. And we have RUF in here. Very familiar car company. That's like a off brain of Porsche. So Panifini Digital was like, screw it, let's let's take RUF. I guess. And finally, EA or whatever signed off their deal with um EA. Cause that shit, that, that got annoying. I wanted to, I want to drive to something different. Not this car all the time, which I don't have an issue with, but still, that's just my opinion. Just saying because, RUF, man. It's RUF. One of the most familiar non-branded car companies that I know. And for years, they've been on here. Now we get Porsche. That's amazing. So I have every right to be excited that Porsche is going to be on Gran Turismo. You're damn right I'm happy. I'm going to keep it that way. Or try to. Who knows? But uh, Porsche, I gotta say, is welcome to Gran Turismo Sport, which this isn't Gran Turismo Sport, this is GT6. Okay, oh my god, it's super core! So as I'm driving down the street on here, and I'm trying to enjoy my, enjoy the day, um, yeah, Ruff, you're not resting in peace, you're still here, and your RUF is not dead, um, you can still play RUF for Gran Turismo, but I hardly doubt anyone will. And again, some people really don't. Some people do. Myself, I do. So, um, yeah. I'm, I'm enjoying the rest of my moments with RUF right now. But I can always come back to it. That's right. I wish this car could, like, stay way it is but I can't what do you guys think about my drift bill let me know in the comments down below wall tap I really have an issue with the volume I don't know why I don't know why nope I don't know a single thing I'm gonna try to keep the drift of this car. Can I keep it? Maybe.
Oh yeah, I can. I, ha I can. I can. I'm not, I'm not doing so bad. That was actually not so bad at all. I did pretty damn good. Grass life. And transition. Transition again. Probably the best damn tune yet. That was fun. On the Farizio, that was fun. I'm gonna go backwards and drift. Because that transition was pretty sick. I was raging for a second back there. But I got over it. I'm trying to see if I can hold this car and make it keep drifting. One, two, three. Oh, shit. Didn't hold it for that long. Always in the grass, huh? Yup, definitely. Drifting very slow. I like this little section back here. It's fun. I enjoy that section back there. I gotta hit the minimum of 70 miles an hour. Just to keep it. So I should just keep it a fifth gear. Fifth or fourth. This is dope. Sex is a little crazy. Wall tap. I did mess up a little bit, but I did alright. I did alright though. I ain't, I ain't gonna be mad. I did alright. I did alright. One more time. I'm having fun with this though. Come on. See, I'm always in the grass at this part. Can't seem to get out of it. Apparently the grass is attached to me. Can't seem to stay out the damn grass. Oh my god, that's annoying. Stay out the grass pull train. Start getting in the grass pull train. I'm trying. I'm trying. Don't you dare. Okay. Yep. No drift points. Just drifting freely here. Lifting my spirits up. Who knows? Who knows? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just doing it. I'm winging it right now.
I'm starting to feel a little annoyed with this car. <laughs> I honestly am. So I keep the RUF nice and steady. I can even do that because I suck with this car. It's been a while since I've driven it, and it's a different tune. But it's not the tune; it's the driver. You shit. Yeah, I know I'm shit, guys. Thank you. Honestly, I'm not a not a very good drifter. Um, I need more practice with this car. With any car I use. I know you guys like getting door to door, you know, I try the best of my ability in this game to get better, to, to keep it that way. And I can even keep this, keep this car from spinning out the way I do. Who knows? Alright, fuck, I don't even care anymore. Okay, screw that. This is Bullet Train. I hope you guys enjoyed this video of the the RUF um, Zero Cruise Race, nah, no BS, and all that stuff. Um, all my links are down below. Subscribe if you're not new already. This car is aggravating the hell out of me. Then again, I can't drift worth to save my life because I'm always hitting the grass. Terrible, terrible, terrible. And um, yeah, it is eight. 48 I said 8:40, a.m. and I hope you guys are having a, a great day or something uh, really controller uh, my controller decides I want to turn off on me stupid uh, yeah um, other than that um, RUF or rough whatever BTR 1986 alpha red um, Thank you for being in this um, this video, and it's a German vehicle, mate. So, um, and then you got Porsche, but uh, yeah. Get, leave me your thoughts down below, guys. Do you guys still like RUF? Do you really care about it? Or, I mean, this car has a long history of being on Gran Turismo and stuff. So, and so that now do we now that we finally have Porsche, it's an open door, and we finally get to drive Porsche. But I see it as a very big deal. It is awesome to have Porsche on Gran Turismo for the first time in years. So, all my links are down below. Subscribe if you're not new. Hope you guys enjoyed the video of my terrible drifting. And always hitting the grass because apparently I'm all about the grass life. But we're moving like the speed of sound. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm tired.